What's up, everybody? My Soul K, and we're back. Resident Evil Part 4. Resident Evil Zero Part 4, that is. And, um, this is now my second time trying to do this fucking episode. Because this part is just so annoying. I don't know why. Okay. I don't know why it's so annoying. But it just sucks. It just is not that fun. And that's what I've been experiencing in this game. You know, for the longest time, I'd never played Resident Evil Zero. And now, I think I know why. I'm, I don't know, I'm not, I'm not, in, not enjoying it that much. I don't know why. I just don't like this whole system. I like having an item box, you know, being able to regroup and pick up all my stuff. Putting it in a centralized location. You know, I like that. I don't like all this. I leave stuff everywhere. But that's just me. You know, I, I don't know. But anyway. I've, I've played, I've done this, this boss fight coming up three times, two times now. And there's just, the enemies in this game are not that good, you know? You just get bit once and you're dead. And, you know, can't use the green herbs really. Green herbs don't really do that much. I'll go check over there. Billy, uh, 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 uh. I didn't have to change them. I should have just used the arrow keys. But anyway, what we're doing now is doing this puzzle because there's a key down here that we can get if we just unwind it. The machine has finished winding the chain. No, it hasn't. Start it. Yes. So there we go. We wind up this chain. We see this unnecessary cutscene because, like, we should know that the cage is going to lift up whenever we wind the chain. But what are we going to pick up? What is this? Oh, it's the fire key. Ah, no, it's a stillipede. Ugh. Billy, please help. I'll make quick work of you. With my good old nade launcher. Dude, Rebecca, you're fucked. Oh my fucking god. Are you fucking kidding me? How does it miss? How does it miss? Now I'm out of ammo. Man, fuck this. And he got me too. Oh, 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 I fucking hate that. Oh. <laughs> That's so annoying. Goodbye, centipede. Rebecca. God. Are you all right? Yes. Thank you. All right, we're done with that. I'm gonna go save. I keep neglecting to do this every time. Why are the fucking controls inverted? What the hell is happening? What did? I, whoa, whoa, whoa! What did I just press to get to the map? Q. Dude, that's awesome. I didn't know you could press Q to open up the map. That's so handy. Uh, see, I, I knew. I knew there had to be a key to open up the map. Oh, damn it. I left the ink ribbons in this room. <laughs> if you can't tell, I'm getting a little annoyed with this section of the game. I want it to be over. I want to be on to the next thing. I want to get the fire key. I want to get the water key. I want to get the other sp 
part of the statue so we can balance them out. Yes, please give me these ink ribbons. Now we can go save and not have to do the centipede again. This is the final take. Final, final take. I'm done fighting the centipede. I'm done. I don't like it. I don't like the centipede. It's not fun. <sighs> but now, we can finally go back here. We can go save, and we can have a nice time. We can not, not worry about, about the stupid centipede anymore. We can just save our game. Yes, record data, please. Yes. Thank you. Alright. So there we go. Now it's going to take forever to spell Billy. Oh my god, it's so slow. Alright, there we go. So, now we can go... Billy, why? See, I'm pressing D. Why are the fucking controls inverted? That's so stupid. Oh my god. So, we can open up this first fire door, which is right through this hall. And is the one that we want to open first. After we blow this guy's head off, make sure he doesn't grab us. Whatcha! There we go. So, we need Rebecca to open the door. Billy, get the fuck out of the way. Alright. Open the first fire door. There's only two fire doors. Which is this one and one downstairs. Which this one... No, don't open up that screen. I switch to Billy, please. This one, there's a little little puzzle ruski in here. <coughs> Excuse me. A little puzzle rooney in here. Which we need. This is a classic Resident Evil puzzle, I tell you. Switch here, flip it, yep. Turn on the lights. And watch this. Watch. Watch. Check this out. There's something there's something in the in the moose. What is it, you ask? I don't know. It's an iron needle. Also we're gonna leave the grenade launcher here because we don't have any room for it because we want these shotgun shells so we can load up the shotty bang back to full on that and look at this they're so kind handgun ammo thank you I have been running low for quite some time so thank you for giving me this ammo so we got the iron needle and honestly no idea where it goes. Absolutely zero idea where this iron needle could go. What I do know is that we need to go get the other fire key door so we can save up a space. Which we need to go downstairs for that. Fuck. Not this room. If you're looking for a step by step guide on how to beat Resident Evil Zero, this is not the place. Not the place to go. I'm taking quite inefficient paths to do what we need to do. So don't don't follow my example, please. It's not going to be a good time. So I need to go downstairs for the other fire key door, but I need to I need to make some space. I need to make some space so we can grab some stuff in there. And then I need to figure out where this this fire key goes. Ah, uh, I should have left the grenade launcher here. But we're gonna leave this. I'm gonna leave this. I'm gonna keep the shotgun. Oh shit! I should have taken should have taken the fire key from Rebecca. That's fine. Um, exchange. Actually, you know what? There's a quicker way about going that. So, exchange this for this. Perfect. We're gonna need this gas can. 
Pick up the fucking gas can, Billy. Jesus Christ. God, why won't it pick up the gas can? See, the that's another thing about this game. Use the fielder's key, don't need more. The, the, the hitboxes of the items on the ground are fucking useless. You know, they are just the worst. Lighter fluid, thank you. So look at this, look at this. We combine this with that, and now our lighter works. And we combine this with this, and we got some Molotov cocktails. That's what this was for. The gas can all along. Which I don't know why the gas can was in the first place. If we couldn't use the lighter yet. So that's one thing I don't understand. I don't know. We're going to save all of the Molotovs for boss fights. So we actually, we're going to, we're going to have so much stuff on the ground here. So we're going to leave this. We're going to leave this. Pick up the handgun again. Ammo. I should give the ammo to Rebecca. But, you know, she's just going to waste it. She's going to waste it. So, another thing we can do is I think we can go in here. I think this is where we go. Like I said, I'm not too sure what to do in here. It's like surely there's something we should be able to do something in here. Right? It's like what is this? Night sword firmly bar access to the door. What is this room? I don't remember this. Uh, this is this outside area. Is there anything out here? No. So that door is locked. So how do we... How do we open it? Because that seems to be the... Because, like, that's... That's the fire door, or the water door, right? There's something right there. Oh, that's a grenade launcher. Don't know what that is. That's a knife and a knife. And that's another water door. And that door is also locked. So let's go see what that is. Because we don't know how to open this night door. Uh, hold on. I'm just thinking about this. About what we have to do here. It's like there's, there's not much on how to open that. It doesn't seem. Like there's nothing there. There's nothing here either. Oh, there was that that thing we need that disc for. I think that's how we open that door. All right, so that is useless right now. We can't we can't do anything there. So what can we do? Also, I'm enjoying a nice coffee right now, which I didn't put enough sugar in it. If you can't tell, I'm a little I'm a little uh hyper right now. How, do we, how the hell do we open this? See, the door is locked, but the door doesn't seem to be a keyhole anyway. The top part is engraved with the image of the clock. So, we have to do something with this clock. With this iron needle. Because that obviously goes to a clock, right? What is this? We're missing something. There's gotta be something we're missing. And I'm just not seeing it. Right? Because we have our lighter now. But surely, we gotta be able to do more with the lighter than just... Than just light Molotovs with, with it. <sighs> so, that door is locked. That, what's that? That's, there's a, there's a bad guy in there, I think. I think that's a water door as well. And this, training facility. 
That door is locked. We can't go there anymore. That is also locked. I don't know what that is. Hmm. Okay, so. That, we were, I just know we're missing something. I just don't know what. It has to be this door. It has to be this door. But how do we open it? Artist scaffolding. Perhaps we're restoring painting. <laughs> no. Give me that lighter back. <clears throat> so, let's see. Whoa, whoa, wait a second. Wait a second. I think I know what to do. I think I know what to do. So, this door in here was not a water door or a clock door, right? Yes. Candle is burnt out. See, look. Here is what we were missing. Here it is. Let's go. Door unlocked. Alright. And let's find out what was in here. What did we leave? Ink ribbons. Okay, that's good to know, actually. It's good to know, because we're running, running a little low on ink ribbons. You know. Holy shit. Blow their fucking heads off. <laughs> oh yeah, grenade launcher ammo. I can take it. Give me that shit. So now we can put that in the grenade launcher. So what the fuck do we do in here? Um, you know what? Put these in here. Save up some space. Biology, the books, wide variety of subjects. Alright. So what do we do? Oh, we can climb up here. The filing cabinet is in a state of total disarray. Can we push this? Yes. Oh, what's this? Take the book of good. What the fuck? The book of good, are you kidding me? Seems unusually heavy for a book of its thickness. Okay, open it. Oh yeah. The angel wings. So now we can go combine it with that statue. Glad we took care of those guys. Which we wasted two shells because we're never going to come back in here, I don't think. So that's a little disappointing. Oh well. I'm sure there will be more shotgun shells. And we left the grenade launcher over here, so I'm gonna 
gonna leave these on the ground here. So when we're on our way to go get the grenade launcher again, we can we can grab those shells on the way. But let's finish this puzzle. It's over here. Oh, I wonder what door it will unlock. Du -du -bu -bu -bu, grab the statue. Remove the statue. Yes, right. Then combine them, and we'll be good to go. But I don't see how that's gonna be balanced, though. It has two wings. The other one has one wing. Unless it just works. See, look. I miss. I gotta be missing something here. What is happening? Something when good and evil are brought into balance, a new path will be open for you. <sighs> or maybe because we haven't missed anything, I don't think. Hmm. Because I we would have definitely seen this, or maybe oh we definitely got to find the book of evil. I bet because we found the book of good. We found the we found the book of good. So let's see where we need to go. I think we need to go back to that library. Because oh, the um, Rebecca. Give me the needle. Give me the needle, please. Alright, Billy, let's go. Let's go back to that, that library. Because I think the clock is in there. That makes sense, right? <clears throat> Has to make sense. Because, where else? Remember those all those like clock gears and shit? So it would make sense that the clock was in there, don't you think? Or actually, I think we need to go to the top part. Which we definitely can't reach from here. Yeah. So let's see, how do we get back there? Because that is definitely where we need to go. I am 800% sure of it. I just need to know how to get there. So. We need to go back to where we fought the guy at. Go through there. So, yes. Alright, alright. I know where to go. I know where to go. It may look like I don't know where to go, but I do, in fact, know where to go. So, let's see. Go across here. Right. Has to be. And we go... Fuck. We go back to where Rebecca is. Got to this main area. That is where we go. And we go here. Yes. We go here. Boom. Perfect. And then go here. No, 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 not in here. No. <sighs> Damn it. Go back. So, go up the stairs. We got this, we got this. We know what we're, what we're doing. How you guys doing? I might have already asked you that, but I can't remember. Because this is my second time, third time making this video. So I forget what I've asked already. And when I did. Like I said, I'm enjoying a nice coffee right now. Also, this weekend... 
this weekend, I will be gone. I'm going to a concert in Maine with some friends. We're watching uh, Greta Van Fleet. Is this where I need to go? Because I don't want to deal with those birds again. Yes, it is God. I guess I could just bring Rebecca with me. I don't remember how to get there. Fuck you, bird! I'm gonna fucking die. I'm gonna fucking die. I'm gonna be so pissed off. So where am I at? like how the fuck do you do you stop that whatever I'm just gonna go I'll just take the long way cause I'm not fucking dying fuck those birds man the fucking aim in this is garbage those birds are just invincible I guess like, come on, dude. Alright, Rebecca, come this on. Way. Roger. God, if I would have died, if I had died right there, I would have been angry. I don't know why. Would have ruined the rest of this playthrough for me. Because it would have pissed me off. So bad. I'm not fucking doing this episode again. Like, come on. Be, be real with me. We'll just have to do this the old fashioned way. Rebecca has the iron Let's needle. Up. Roger. I can't see the lift, so I can't control her independently. Oh my god, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Come on. Roger. We have to go out there. Are you serious? You gotta be joking. That's so stupid. Oh my god, if I die. Ooh, 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 ooh. It's gonna be over. I'm gonna be so angry. If I die, <sighs> okay. all right, here we go. We're doing it. We're doing it. Can't believe that this is the only way there. <coughs> Excuse me. Allergies might be coming back. It's getting me that time of year. You guys excited for Halloween? I'm excited. Halloween's gonna be fun. I love this time of year. Alright, fuck you, bird. Fuck you. Fuck you. Where's the other one? Alright, where do I need to go? Is that's where we need to go. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Ugh. Not dealing with it. That'd be so unfortunate if I didn't have the the, the needle. See so yeah, it goes here, right? The minute hand is missing from the dial. Yes. So then we put it on 815. Move the hands. Yes. Turn the minute hand. So minute hand, we need to turn it right to 15. This is way better controls than the first one. So then 11, 10, 9, 8. There we go. And where did that open? 
Opened all the clock doors. Is it just two? Yeah. All right. So let's go. Let's go visit these clock doors. I think we're done here. We're done. Fuck that bird. All right. So let's go back to Rebecca. And we might be done here with this episode because I am ready for the weekend and I actually have some shit to go do. And I'm kind of over this this episode, which I know it, it doesn't sound like it. Like I know I'm sounding a little, little chipper here, but this was a pain in the ass. That centipede fight. Like, come on. Come on. Roger. So there's a first door right there that we have not been into. So let's just check. It's like, yeah, see, that door is open now, so we can go in that room. So we need to go there and there. And that's the only two doors that have opened. And then I'm, I'm assuming after that, we're going to get the, the water door. And we're going to get to go into here. And there was another water door. I don't remember where. Maybe it was just that one. But then I bet we're going to get the Book of Evil. And we're going to be able to complete the scales. So, yeah. Where are the ink ribbons? Ink ribbons, please. Save up. Record data. Yes, please. Thank you. Ugh. We've already had six saves, and we're only on the fourth episode. But some asshole driving outside. All right, so we did it. We beat another boss, and we unlocked some doors, and we unlocked another set of doors after that. Big episode. Lots of things happening. Next episode, we're gonna be getting through all those those clock doors. Jesus. We're gonna be getting those clock doors, and I bet we're gonna get the next set of doors after that too, and maybe even move on from the training facility. So thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you next one. Well, before that, have a nice weekend. Have a nice Indigenous Peoples Day. Don't be like that asshole driving outside. Don't drive your car really loud. Let everyone enjoy their nice weekend. So have a good one. I'll see you next one. Peace.